Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another Sam's Club grocery haul. I got a ton of stuff. Um, the price was a little over $400. There are two items that are not going to be in the video because I already dropped them off at my mother-in-law's house and my sister-in-law's house. It was a three pack of Kraft American cheese and then a pack of flushable uh, wipes. So let me flip you around. We'll hop right into it because I literally just got home, got everything set up. Little babe is still in the car seat and he's gonna start getting cranky pretty soon. So <laughs> I gotta fly through this. <laughs> Um, I asked Amelia if she wanted waffles or French toast sticks and she opted for the French toast sticks. We haven't had members mark brand before. I'm sure it's fine. I'm sure it's delicious. And I got some more Dunkin' Donuts coffee. This has been really good. Um, I've actually liked it better than some of my Starbucks that I buy for home. And Bella said they were almost out of croissants. So we picked up another box of that. I got Amelia some more milk and I didn't really go in with like a grocery list. I had a list of things that I needed to get and then we just kind of scanned the rest of the store. Um, but I did go ahead and get two heads of lettuce. I am craving a salad so I think I'm going to do salads for dinner tonight maybe. And then the girls wanted some more mandarin oranges. These have no added sugar in them. I know that's loaded with sugar probably. I didn't even check it. I, I really didn't even check. It has, oh boy, 14 grams of added sugar for four sticks. She'll probably eat like two, maybe three in a serving. Anyways, it's all about balance. Um, I got another five pound bag of mild cheddar cheese. We go through this stuff like crazy and then I think I have a pack in the pantry, but I was there, so I went ahead and got another pack of the Carb Balance. I really like the brand from Aldi, but since I was there at Sam's, I went ahead and got this. It's four grams of net carbs for one. And then I got Jason the big burrito size uh, tortillas and some more avocados. I like to get mine when they're really green like this so that they don't go bad really quickly because sometimes we forget about them and then don't eat them. And the girls love these Jack Link beef steaks. So I got another box of these. I just put these in their lunch or sometimes they'll have them as an afternoon snack. And was starting to run a little bit low on my downy, um, what are these called? Unstoppables, downy unstoppables. <laughs> so I got another bottle of those. And this week, I just feel like I needed my life to be a little bit easier. I'm going to be working Monday through Thursday, off Friday, because the little man has a doctor's appointment, and then working Saturday if they have patients that need to be seen. And I was like, you know what, I just don't feel like packing lunches. So the girls enjoy these. I don't buy these very often, so I went ahead and got them. You get three ham and three turkey. Um... I know I could do this on my own, but sometimes I just need the convenience food. <laughs> and I saw this and I thought, you know, it's been kind of rough on everyone. So I thought the girls could have some ice cream and make their own little Sunday creation. And I'm not even going to look at the added sugars because I don't want to know, but I thought this would be fun for them to do with Jason tonight after dinner and just make their Sundays, their ice cream a little bit more special. If you watched my video that I just posted about having a new baby in the house, you will understand um, this has been hard on all of us, even the girls. They're loving having him here, but you know, emotions have been crazy. So I just wanted to do something a little extra special for them. So we got the Sunday creations. And then I got the um, zero added or zero sugar Kool-Aid jammers for, um, for their lunches or just to have a little drink after school. And then two boxes of the Honey Nut Cheerios. And Amelia's never had Fruity Pebbles, so she talked me into Fruity Pebbles. <laughs> There's 12 grams of added sugar for one cup, so... I don't think she even eats like a whole full cup of cereal whenever I make it for her in the morning, but um, 
she wanted to give it a try. And then some Cheez-Its for snacks for their lunch or snack after school. And then we needed some more paper plates and they just had like flimsy ones and then the styrofoam kind. So I decided on getting the Chinette ones. They are a little more expensive, um, but these are actually made from what's it say? recycled material and compostable. So um, I did go ahead and get those. I hope you can put them in the microwave. I think you can, I don't know. I didn't check and see. And then I needed some more detergent. I still have some, but I don't wanna run out of it or anything. So I went ahead and got another container of that. And then I got some more American cheese for us and some bananas. Um, bananas I like to get green as well so they don't go bad before we can eat all of them. And then I don't know what was going on, but for some reason, everybody was buying up all the water bottles. I was gonna get some anyways. Our water goes out a lot. They were redoing the pipes and stuff, and we're always on our water boil and all that stuff. So I like to keep water bottles on hand anyways. So I went ahead and got a pack of those, but they were flying off the shelf. So I'm not sure what's going on. Bella said, are, are we having a hurricane or something? I was like, all right. Don't think so, we're not in hurricane season yet, so I don't know what's going on. Um, and then I got some more Gatorade Zero. This is really good for when Bella has soccer practice. Spring soccer is officially over, thank goodness. It's so funny because when we, have, when we don't have soccer, it's like, man, I really miss going. And then when it gets about midway, it's like, oh my goodness, I'm so over it already. <laughs> um, but it's over, but we're still doing competitive soccer. So Bella uh, made the competitive soccer team. They are already starting their practices, even though it's not until fall. So I still wanted to get her some uh, Gatorade Zero. And then I like to send this in Amelia's Thermos for PE because they do PE outside and their coach is amazing. He actually makes them work. I love him. He, when my daughter went there, my oldest daughter, and when Bella was there, out of the coaches that they had, Amelia's coach is top notch like he is the best he makes it fun for them but they're actually exercising and working so I love it so I did want to get more of that for them and then I needed some more toilet paper and we were down to one roll of paper towels so I had to get some more paper towels and for daycare they asked for like two bags I think of um, wipes uh, wipe refills they don't have the kind that I used to buy when Amelia was a baby it was Huggies you got the little box the plastic box that you would refill it and the refills came in a bag and you pulled them like a big bag and you pulled them out of that put them in the plastic tub and that was it but now they're in these little packs and I like those for putting in the diaper bag but I don't like those for putting in the little plastic tubs um, for like the changing table and stuff. I don't know. I wish they would leave stuff alone sometimes, <laughs> but they didn't have what I wanted. So this will have to do, I'll probably send in like half of half the box of these for daycare. And then they also wanted a box of diapers. I've never used Members Mark brand. I was hoping they had loves. They did have loves, but not little man's size he's still in a size one um so i couldn't get the loves and the pampers i always bought the pampers for the girls but they're super expensive so i decided and he's using loves right now and i really like them i've had two pee pee leaks and one poop leak and that's it so i really like them and they even have the little line on the front showing if he's peed or not so i really like them they've uh kind of stepped up their game from when i tried them back with my oldest daughter which was 22 years ago <laughs> and then daycare also asked for a few boxes of tissue so i went ahead and got the puffs i'll keep some of them here and then send in some of those so that's all the actual grocery type items and y'all know Y'all know I can't go into Sam's without looking at the clothes and end up buying clothes. This is so cute though. Bella wanted this. It's flowers and grace. No, flowers and grace. Flowers and fur. And it's got a little 
golden retriever and some flowers. He's so cute. And then she loves these kind of shorts. These are Calvin Klein. She likes these for um, soccer practice and just hanging out at the house and stuff. And they've got the little uh, lining in them, the little panty lining. So I got those for her. And then I got this one for myself, coffee till martinis or drinks or wine, whatever you want to call it. I love this. Y'all know I love my coffee and you know I love my wine. <laughs> so this is me to a T. I got an extra large. I probably, I didn't hold it up and look at it. Probably should have got a large, but oh well, it is what it is. And then I think I have four pairs of these now. I love them. So I ended up getting another pair. I went ahead and got a large again. Um, hopefully in the next couple of months they still have them and I'll get a medium because you know I'm still doing keto and going to start working out again once we get on a better routine better schedule so hopefully they'll have those still and I'll get some mediums I love them and then I couldn't pass these up for uh Kaysen. isn't that cute it has a little well and then the little fin is off to the side and flaps and this one has sailboats on it and wells. And then this one's just plain. I may get my silhouette out and do some kind of little um, decal on it or something for him. And then, oops. And then this one has wells and lighthouses and octopus, so cute. And then this one's just a solid gray. So very, very cute. These are really nice for the summer here in Florida. You just put this on him and he's good to go. And that is it. And that is everything. Like I said, my total was a little over $400. I don't have the receipt with me. Um, I'll put it on the screen. I've got to hurry up and put this cold stuff away. Get little man out of his car seat and let him stretch out a little bit. He was so good. He was really, really good in the store. So I still had my Lily Baby carrier from when I had Amelia. And I, when we got to Sam's, I ended up having to feed him. So he has to stay upright for at least 30 minutes. And I knew I was going to have a cart full of groceries. I didn't want to have to deal with pushing the stroller and then pushing the grocery cart as well. So I just put him in the carrier, which holds him upright. So he didn't have any spitting up until we get back out to the car and I put him in his car seat. Then he spit up a little bit. I was like, really? Come on, dude. <laughs> You gotta stop this. But he was really good. He slept the whole time he was in there. And um, it was a workout because I had him on the front and then I had the diaper bag that I bought my daughter it is a backpack diaper bag. It's really cute. So I had that on my back and then pushing this big old heavy cart. So I think I got a workout in. It was, um, <laughs> it was funny. And by the time I got back out to the car and I took the carrier off and everything, my shirt in the front and back was just sweat. <laughs> so, but he enjoys it. He loves the carrier. And that's what I do sometimes when we're at home. I just put him in that after I feed him because I have stuff I gotta do. So I can't just sit there all the time and hold him. So I just put him in the carrier and walk around and get stuff done. So anyways, I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Click on that red subscribe button if you haven't done so already. Go ahead and click on that bell as well so that you don't miss any of my videos. And I will see you in the next one. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.